hello everyone. Here's Bowen from uh, Lisbon. Today is uh, May 25th, and I'm in uh, basically in uh, Amadora uh, or Afrigid uh, Benfica area. It's it's uh, I'm a little confused, uh, but anyway, now finally I realize this is the area um, I started uh, to have my sort of a life here in uh, in Portugal. Uh, I stayed in the Holiday Inn uh, Express um, after I finished a little bit work here. So now finally today I took my, uh, my, my train first then took the bus. Now finally I realized oh this is the area I was uh, here for roughly about 10 days. So it reminds me a lot of things. Anyways, uh, today I'm gonna just make a, a, a short video to uh, remember what I have now. I'm coming to this uh, largest uh, Leroy Merlin uh, construction store uh, in the Benfica area. This is the, uh, the largest uh, Leroy Merlin in uh, Lisbon. So this is the uh, Allegro, it's a shopping mall. It's uh, the first uh, sort of a shopping mall. Uh, no, the second. Uh, I came uh, after I moved to uh, Portugal. So it's uh, just like a normal shopping mall, but when you were uh, nothing to do <laughs> every day, and this is the sort of a mall, I come every day. I came every day for lunch and for, for dinner. So now I'm uh, now I'm completely uh, I'm, I'm actually I, I'm standing here I feel wow what a big uh, difference before I didn't really know anything about Portugal but now I've known a lot uh, okay so I want to talk about uh, Portugal's transportation I, this is uh, sort of a first time I really uh, uh, tried uh, Portugal public uh, transportation, uh, train and uh, bus and uh, walking and uh, it looks like a uh, pretty far from uh, where I live now but uh, you know uh, if I take a Uber probably about 12, uh, 10 to 12 dollars but if I take a, a, a public transportation, it might be just uh, half of the price. And uh, the interesting part is you see uh, different things and you experience different things. So that's something, you know, I, I can't believe how convenient and how easy this transportation here in uh, Portugal. So if you don't really uh, have a car, that's totally fine. So this is finally, I'm here, the largest uh, Leroy Merlin in Lisbon. This is something very different from Canada. This is uh, made uh, from concrete. It's very heavy. It's all concrete. Wow, I thought it's a plastic. Wow, it is a very big and they carry more stuff here. I look at the price, right? Mm -hmm. It's um, 140 times 280 uh, for three pieces, 24, like a 25 euro. It's not bad. So there's some uh, cheaper ones too. So basically for tables legs and they have a ready to go sort of a legs it's easy that's the 
the one I want. Okay, that's the one. See, this is my favorite area. There's a nice piece of wood. Okay, I went to another one. They don't have this uh, kind of a style uh, here a lot. Look at the price, right? But compared to Canada, that's just uh, day and night. Okay, so this is the one that I'm going to try to make something. This is the one they show you how to make this, something like this. It's fantastic. I can't believe it. If, I hope uh, it's right. This, uh, this legs, this uh, steel uh, metal sort of legs is 28 uh, euro. I have to double check. $42. I can't believe this is uh, way, 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 way cheaper than Canada. All these uh, metal legs. I don't understand uh, why in Canada these stupid things are so expensive. table legs or whatever the legs so so many kinds if you look at this you know what you never want to buy those uh, tables the fake wood this is really something you can practice This is uh, um, the area that you can uh, uh, have your wood cut by them. There are a lot, so I'm not so worried about it. It took me roughly about uh, almost two hours just look around everything, almost pretty much everything. And uh, I have to admit, this is the, it is the largest uh, Leroy Merlin uh, store in uh, Lisbon. Absolutely and highly recommended if you want to uh, decorate uh, your place, your new home in Portugal. This is the place you have to come. This is also a, a good place to buy things. I knew this place a long time ago when I stayed in the hotel uh, nearby. Uh, this is uh, a, a place, sort of a more uh, high-end decoration place. Um, well, at first I wanted to come to to see the bed and everything, but now I changed my mind. I think that uh, Conforama, uh, in price-wise, is uh, better. And this one is sometimes can be very expensive. Well, I don't know how I feel, but I feel excited to see this uh, hotel, Holiday Express. I stayed in this hotel for roughly about two weeks, 10 days. And uh, today, after uh, two months, I came back and uh, feel, wow, <laughs> something very different, hard to uh, tell. <laughs>